the shooting at the LGBT club is not surprising at all, especially when you consider the kind of people he might be listening to. People like Ben Shapiro, people like Matt Walsh, people like Tucker Carlson, basically every single elected uh, Republican. These people have been screaming on top of their lungs and saying that trans people are coming to get your children. They are coming to indoctrinate them, they are coming to cut off your VV and make you a fucking woman. This kind of bullshit has been spewed on every single YouTube channel owned by these people and every single niche channel. It's not surprising at all that one of their followers decided to do something like this. Now, these people will of course go around saying that it's not their fault. They will blame it on uh, mental health, they will blame it on every other factor other than themselves. And funnily enough, these are the same people who go around and say that uh, conservative thought is being suppressed, which is blatantly false. As you can clearly see that Ben Shapiro, Matt Walsh, Trevor Files and all these people are still have the platforms. If anything, they're promoted by these websites because they get the clicks, they get the views, they get the watch time. Honestly, these people should really consider what their role in society is. Is it to sow hate and divide people or do something much better other than licking the boot of the corporation than the people who fund them?